Hey guys, how you doing today? This is James Ryan from the Sports Lions Den, uh, aka the Sports Lion. Um, for all you card sharks, sports sharks, and all around sharks out there, please just welcome to the channel. I know there's a lot of people out there that are probably curious on um, whenever I decide to buy uh, Pokemon cards, I will actually decide to open them as much as I can in front of you guys. But uh, let me tell you something. I went and bought two of the pack. I bought a whole bunch of different things from uh, three packs to single packs to I even bought a sword and shield figure collection case. I opened them all opened up all the packs so it would make it easier a little bit. Um, I can also throw a XY evolution pack in there too that I've already opened up but I got so many today. It's uh, not even funny. I mean I got we're going to see how many ultra rares we can find in the whole bunch of card packs I got here. So let me tell you exactly what I've got currently. I have three evolutions. I have a guard, one Guardians Rising. I've got four Cosmic Eclipse packs, one Crimson Invasion, one Roaring Skies, one Team Up. One Primal Clash. Um, let's see. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine Rebel Clash. A base set Sun and Moon. And two base set Sword and Shield cards. So, first of all, let's see what we can get. I'm, I'm trying for those Hypers. Or those uh, Ultra Rares. Ultra Rares are always good to go. But... For all of you that haven't been on this channel, you know I'm putting uh, binders together, putting decks together. I'm putting one of every card, and actually I'm putting more than just one binder together each time so I can actually sell them off. And you guys might be able to get them if you, uh, as soon as I finish one at least. So hopefully if you guys are watching this, please subscribe. I will tell you in later videos if I have one finished. Uh, currently, I think my uh, Sword and Shield one is almost complete. I just got to wait for a lot of the hypers. So let's open these cards up. And I'm literally, I've actually been inventorying every one, a single one of my cards. So it's actually one of those things that uh, I'm cu currently at like $325, just nickel and diamond, all the from five cent. I round, I do my rounding to every by the nickel. So basically, some cards are going to be five, some cards are going to be 10 cents. Uh, anything that's over 50 cents or over, I'm put them in a little sleeve. So I've got a lot of, as a matter of fact, I've got three cards that are actually just, um, I haven't, haven't put them in the binder, but they're valuable uh, in that regards because I actually, from this XY evolution, I've now got two Zapdos uh, cards, uh, holographs. So it's not too bad. Um, code card for anybody that wants it. Let's see what we can do with these XYs. Let's see if it's a good one. All right, let's see. Hey, good start. Brock's Grit. Professor Oaks. Hit. Metapod. I got a Ghastly. A Caterpie. A Drowsy. A Magikarp. An Electabuzz. A Reverse Hollow Switch. Woo-wee! That... One right there, a Mega Blastoise EX to start the day off. Oh, my Lord. We're going to have a good day. Hold on. Oh, we're going to pull the, that. <clears throat> um, And I actually believe I got one already in my, in my first uh, Evolutions binder. So, luckily for me, we're going to keep that right there. We're going to see what else we get. Because now I gotta log all these cards. Once I get done with this, I gotta log all these cards in. I actually put them on a spreadsheet so I actually know exactly how many of each card I have. So hopefully we do some good. All right, so cards fly away, fly away. All right, let's see what we get here. Three cards. All right. <coughs> Coughing. Oh. Misty's Determination. Ooh, a revive. 
Ooh, I like that one. A do duo, a star you, a seal, a charmander, a magnemite. I think no, and I need a magneton. Wait a minute. Yeah, that was kind of nice. And a Gyarados holographic. Uh, let me just check right here. I'm actually looking on the website here, and I'm going to tell you, it's um, I use TCG Player all the time. So if you guys are, uh, this one's going to be okay. That's a fifty-six dollar card too, or fifty-six cent card. My bad. I was looking, but when I see something that's like. Mm, Anywhere close to the five or the ten cent mark, like this one, I'm gonna say it's gonna be a fifty-five cent card. Uh, that Mega Blastoise right now, as we currently speak, is a four dollar and sixty cent card. So, not bad. We're about five bucks in on valuables at least. So, let's go over here. Let's check this these cards out. Um, all right, we're going to go back over. Luckily, I'm doing this on – I've actually been doing this on my little computer here. It's a, for all you guys out there that need a computer, I actually got this one for about a little under 200 bucks for a um, Acer Chromebook 315. So it's actually working pretty well, so – Got its own built-in little cam uh, webcam and everything of that nature. So, ooh, another green card. Because hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. So, let's see what we get, guys. I got another Misty's Determination, a Revive, Nidorino, a Seal, a Charmander, a Diglett, a Drowsy, a Caterpie. A Pidgeot's Spirit Link. You see that, guys? You see that? And a Mega Venusaur. Guys, look at this card. Oh, my Lord. It's going to be funny as heck right now. So, uh, and I'm telling you right now, this is a lot of live TV right now that I'm doing. These live broadcasts, it seems like they do a lot better with the when I'm able to talk on them. Uh, let's see how much that Mega Venus sort is right now. And I'm going to uh, – just a regular Mega Venus sort. Uh, <coughs> number two, um, $2.45 from what I, I would say. So – yeah, shoot, three pulls, and we've got three cards worth of value. We're not doing too bad. All right, now we're going to go into my Rebel Clash. So let's see if we can get back over here to – um. all right, Rebel Clash, Rebel Clash. Where are we at? Where are we at? I know I'm crazy. Don't have to tell me. I like it. So currently that was – one. All right, all right, all right. <clears throat> oh, hold on one second, guys. I'm just doing texted somebody because they wanted to know some information more. Um. So basically, like I said, we're just doing – I'm showing you guys right now. This is just the fun that I'm having, uh, opening up these cards. I'm trying to get it before the daylight shows up because I still got to put all these cards in. the. I'll be probably up all night put logging a lot of these cards into the computer. So, all right, now we're going to do some little Rebel Clash, guys. All right, let's see who we got. And look, look, we've got – if it – Holds true. 
We've got some green, the white and green. So let's go with some fighting energy. A um, more Pecco. Capacitious bucket. I'm scared. I'm really scared of this energy. Not to. Not you. Not I'm not to. Barboach. Squovet. Applin. Temple. Bronzong. I don't know if it. No, that's just an uncommon. And ooh, a full art toxicity V, guys. I just pulled this. Oh, it was a good day to go Pokemon shopping. I swear, I swear, I swear. So let's see what we got here. <coughs> and we're going to go down. down. I'm going to go check the price for toxicity right now. And I'm going to give you the what I can see of how much the value is right here on the live stream. Um, a full art Toxtricity V, that is a $7.35 card. <clears throat> oh, my Lord. And that's, a, yeah, that's one eighty two. So hopefully. So I went like this. I'm like, I'm really interested in all the uh, the in entertainment that you guys have um well i might not be doing very many shows because due to the fact is that i work i live here in las vegas nevada and i work at one of the casinos here that i might not be able to afford big numbers like i'm doing now but i will see what i could do and try to give you guys a little bit of a show that's your show there uh, for the code cards right there for the guys that are using it. All right, let's see what we can do. All right. One, two, three, four. All right. Ta-da. But let's see. All right. All right. Difficult. Never mind. I'm already losing the train of thought. Spencer, how you doing today? Uh, I got yourself an energy. You got yourself an electrode. A hey, beware. I don't know if I need that beware. But I'm putting a one bend. I know I have my, my sword and shield. I've got actually two binders I'm pr trying to build right now full for the sets. Uh, Palisand, Bunnelby, a Phantom, a Dreepy, a Galarian Far Fetched, a Honedge. You know, that's the second time he's done that to me. Give me the card and then the reverse hollow of it. And a wish cash. Wish cash. <coughs> yeah. But you know, guys, this is gonna be fun because like I said, not only do I got all those, I got all these right here that I I bought a whole bunch of different packs and I just I actually had to open them before I came to the game. Became online tonight and actually put them in the uh there because the fact is I got so many things. I had bought a Pokeball tin. I bought, um, like I said, a figure collection bin. And a, one that gave me three pins of the Tapus without Tapu Coco. I got Tapu Lele, Tapu Bulu, Tapu Fini. Uh, these cards were – so what we're trying to do is we're trying to get – I've already – let's see. That's already – Three valuable or four valuable pulls and three ultra rares. Your go cards for anybody that uses them. And I'm still at, yeah, I'm still at Sword and Shield. Okay. Let's see. Can I say water energy? Oh, I was close. It's a blue, bluish color. All right. I got another Palace Sand. I got a Milo. Turf Field Stadium, Barboach, an Aracuda. I don't know if I got a Barracuda or anything like that. A Stuffle, a Lotad, a Growlithe, an Electabuzz, and a Galarian Weezing. Let's see. First of all, I want to do something. I want to see how much these Galarian Weezings are because if they're a full art, they're going to be worth some cash. And I'm – for all you guys, like I said before, I always use TCG 
player.com for the uh, – and, yeah, that's actually – right now that's holding off at about $0.80 cents value at this moment. So I went like this. I, a lot of these cards that I bought – so if it's over at 50 cents, I'm going to uh, sleeve it. So that's actually four sleeves, right? Five sleeved up cards. Uh, let's see, some wish cash. I forgot to check up on wish cash. I apologize, guys. Um, nah, he's not worth that much. <clears throat> he's only worth 10 cents right now. But uh, <laughs> all right, let's see what else we got for the numbers going on here. And one thing I'm trying to do is I'm trying to give you guys like – and the number's always going to change no matter how many times – like at the prices. Like I've been watching this uh, – my Mega Blastoise go, EX go up from like 625. Now it's up about 20 cents up from when I, when I first got it. So it's actually making its value run right now from what I've seen. And I have – and this one I've just got – so now I've got two. So all right. Fire energy, guys. Now the water energy shows up. All right, guys. Let's see what we get here. I got an Indeedy. Skyla. Now nah, that's a... She looks like she wants to dance. You, want, you guys want to dance with Skyla? All right. No problem. Uh, Electrode. Helliptiotile. A Voltorb. Hey, join your Electrode buddy. Sandigas. Hey, Vulpix. Hey, Coffee. A Bronzong and a Galarian Persian. Let me see how much. And I'm gonna go check on that Galarian Persian because always we, <coughs> you never know what rare is gonna be worth something, even if it's well, Galar Galarian Berserker. My bad, I said Persian, but it's still it comes from the Meowth family. So, all right, guys. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to have some fun now. Just checking to see if it's still light outside. Woo! I don't know if that's a clue or not, guys, but there's your code card. And there. One, two, three, four. Do we have a good one? Let's see. Lightning energy. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. That means it's, we're going to have some good luck here, guys. I got a Halucha. Um, indeed, he wanted to go with it. Charge a bug. I got a Voltorb. And you guys are seeing these cards as, like for the first time like I am. Nosepass. Wingle. Phantom. Bronzong. Uh, Impidimp. And a Galarian Cursola. So, wow. And it's a hollow rare, too. So, let's see if we can find... That's worth it. It's a worth the sleeve because it's at the 50 cent mark right now. So we're going to put that in there. We're going to add that to our collection later. So literally I have six, six sleeved up cards right now, which is always a good sign, especially when I've probably opened up um, one, two, three, eight cards. <clears throat> that means I'm making a little bit of some value. I love watching these card values. and I'm, uh, Thank you for the like, guys. Uh, let's see if we could get some more likes here. If you got some friends of yours, please let them know about the show. Um, whenever I can, I try to get it up here on here. So uh, I appreciate everything. It gives me something to do. It gives you guys something to watch. I might be a little entertaining, may not be, who knows, but uh, we'll figure it out later in life. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to do this. We're, oh, I forgot to do the uh, whoo thing, but we got some fire energy, a capacious bucket, a turf field stadium, a car call, a pit of, a holiptiotile, a Voltorb. Damn, damn it, I keep getting all these Voltorbs. Santa gas, Volpix. Galar Mine and a Sizor or Scizor, whatever you want to call him. I 
You call it a potato. I call it a potato. How how's that sound? Uh, Sizor is only twenty cents. He does not get no sleeve. <clears throat> but all right. But I know if we can ever find a scoop up net, that's going to be getting a sleeve too. Because the fact is, I'm seeing that it's a scoop up net just for the uncommon is on is about seventy cents right now. You don't really. And for guys, a lot of the people out there, they believe that uh, the big number, the big, big Pokemon, yeah, they're a lot of money. But you know what? You're always going to get mostly common cards. You want to give um, – the common cards can also be anything from 5 to $0.10 cents worth of value. If you add all that up, that is still a lot of cash that you can actually make off of them, especially if you got a lot of one. Uh, I got about nine or, or I think I got now about 12 different Galarian Pamitas. So it's uh, from this one set. So it's like I'm trying to figure out, uh, trying to put the sets together. It's a fire energy. It's hot. But uh, like I said, it's one of those things that you guys are going to have to have some fun with. Um, who's on the speed? Pelipper, Metapod, Honedge, Temple, Vullaby, Galarian Corsola, Toxel. It go good with my toxicity. Uh, Stunky and an Electivire. Let's see, Electivires. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna help you out here. We're 15 cent electivires. Nah. I got only two more Rebel Clash uh, things here. So let's see what else we get, guys. Oh. You know what? These are very, very interesting. Hard. All right. Code card for anybody that wants to use it. So let's see here. I got to get back. Metapod, a burning scarf. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. Olina, you know what? Let me double check on that because I think that Olina might be some kit. Um, I know a lot of a lot of trainer cards are actually worth some money because they're playable. Um, that one unfortunately is only about a ten cent, so it's not worth anything. Uh, in pit, in Yeah, I can't even say that was a tote. Magmar. That's interesting. How'd that one get upside down? Electabuzz. Squawbit. Galarian Farfetched. Impidimp. And an Arcanine. Let's see. I know Arcanine's up there, but I don't think he's worth a sleeve. <coughs> I apologize. Nope, he's only a 22 cent. So basically 20 cent for me. All right. But you know what? It's going to be one of those fun things, guys. It's just uh All right. Come on. Open up. Open up. Open sesame. Let's see. Ah, geez. It's only a greenback, so we're not going to do much of anything, I don't think. So let's see what we get here. And here we go. Psychic. Dark. Dag, damn it. All right, guys. <clears throat> Beware. Palisand. Training Court. Nose Pass. Wingo, fly away, Wingo, fly, fly. <coughs> Coughing. Bronzor, a Toxel, a Palpitoad, and a Snorlax. Hey, he goes with my little buddy. Let's see what. And let's see, Snorlax, Snorlax. We'll check up on all the rares. Let's see what we can get. So, all right, all right, all right. Let's see here. 
20 cents for a Snorlax. So that goes for all – that took care of all of my uh, – my Rebel Clash, as they say. Uh, let me just double check one thing. I was making sure that it had everything, or at least something. Now, I got all these still left to go. Let's go with some Guardians Rising. How's that? That sounds good, buddy. Let's get back up here and see if we can uh, possibly check. Yeah. All right. Guardians Rising. Guardians Rising. Right there. All right. We'll do, help you out there. <coughs> And for you guys joining the show, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, let's see how many what we can do with this. I don't know how long this show is going to be. So if you guys ever want to leave anytime, I hey, it doesn't. Thank you for just popping in to see how I, we say hi and everything. But uh, yeah, another green card. It's my green card. Luckily, I'm from California. I swear it feels like another country. But um. There we go. There's your code card for all you guys out there. I forgot which one I was using. Okay, XY. Here we go, guys. We're going to go with some... Um, some Altar of the Moon. We're going to go Weeping Bell. A Golaly. A Saladin. Stuffle. You know what? I think he's kind of an interesting character. I like that Stuffle beware combo. Slowpoke. Wishy washy. Washy wishy. Nose pass. A trubbish. And a travant. So looking at the Guardians Rise, and we're going to check to see who. We're going to see if that travant is worth anything. I always want to make sure I'm gonna on this show. I want to see if all my rares are actually worth something, and I don't just sleeve up the the hollow or the uh, ultra rares. I also sleeve up the ones that are got some value to it, and that one does not because that's one looking at me at fifteen cents right now. So that's the first. Well, we're gonna go back to a little bit of some sword and shield, and we're gonna do some uh. Some fun. I only got two sword and shield packs, and then I got I still got some other ones that we're looking into. So, like I said, I don't know how long this video is gonna take. So if you guys want to stick around and just have some fun with me and enjoy what I'm pulling too, please do so. I always appreciate the company. So uh, let's see what we do. Man, more green. It's my green card again. All right, there's your code card for you guys. All right. <clears throat> uh, Benja, how you doing today? Skadlix, how you doing? So let's see. Which one was I on? Sword and Shield? All right, we're good. There we go. There we go. We can make it work. We'll make it work. Dark Energy. Air Balloon. And I think we're looking for the secret rare air balloon on that one. Yeah, we are. A Pile Pad, a Kingler, a Score Bunny, a Silicobra, a Yamper, a Grookey, a Q Font, a Wooloo, and a Cinderace. Now, this deck actually has three Cinderaces. This one is, I think, the. I do have two of the better ones, but I'm going to tell you right now. Yeah, this one's only about a 20 – this one's about a 30-cent card. Um, the other two are hollow rares, and one's a 35-cent card, and the other one's about a 55-cent card. So if you can get one – if you get the number 34 Cinderace, that's the one that you want out of all the three Cinderaces that you get on this deck. So yeah, just for some information for you guys. I know you guys – so always like some information, especially if you're collecting as well. Uh, 
Me, I normally collect, and for all you guys out there, I normally collect these cards because of the fact is I see the value in them. But the fact is I know not all cards are going to come out the same and go card. And what I do is basically is like I've told people before, I collect them because of the fact is of I put them in binders so I can sell them off to you guys if you guys are interested. But since I haven't even finished an entire binder yet, that's how and I'm so going through some of these cash. I can't wait to get the uh, uh, when August comes out and Darkness Ablaze come, set comes out, so I can start and actually be focused more on that one if I can. So uh, let's hope that it works. Okay. Uh, let's get this dark energy going. Get off of there. A Corva Squire. A Thwacky. Thwackway. Thwacky. 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 Pokemon Catcher. A Vulpix. A Muna. A Rosalia. A Chudo. A Blip Blug. A Lucky Egg. And a Grap. Grap locked. Ooh, you know, I definitely need one of those. I think I do, but let me double check to see how much the value of that grap locked is. Because <clears throat> he is a 20 cent card, but I do need him because I do got a lot of the Octa ones. Oh, Klop Klobatus, I think his name is. I'm still learning some of the new names, so I apologize for Clobopus. Okay, my bad. All right. So we're going to do one thing of Sun and Moon, guys. We're going to do one of the Sun and Moon base set. It's the next one up. So these guys right here set down for a minute. We're going to go all the way down. We're going to check to see if I've got anything from the base set of this Clobopus. Uh, let's see here. What's going to... Ah, I always seem to keep getting these green cards. They're telling me I don't belong here. That's what I'm it's telling me. But, uh... <laughs> All right, guys. So that was a Sun and Moon. So we're going to go for the four-card thing. All right, let's see what we get. Lightning? Lightning. All right. We're going to try this now. We're going to go Lightning. We're going to go Professor Kukui. A Requinid. I don't know. Uh, Nest Ball. Spiro. Psyduck. Eevee. Pick a pick. Pick a pick a pick a buck a pick. A Lowland Marowak. A Parasect. Is that a pet? Hold on. Dropping cards here. Is that a. That is a Hollow Rare. That's a Parasect Hollow Rare and a. Crab abominable. So let's see. For you guys out there that are keeping track with values, please. Um, Crab abominable is only a 14 cent card, but what about this Parasect? Uh, let's check what this little Parasect we got here. That's a 20 cent card. Shoot, the Hollow Rare was much more than the art. So, all right. <clears throat> Let's try a little team up. Let's get a little team up going. And uh, we're going to try something. We're going to. There we go. All right. Let's see what we got here for our Pokemon polls. Pokemon polls. I do. I got a lot of cleanup to do. All right. Know what that means, guys. It means we got something good coming in our way. But let's see. That was the – what I said? That was Sun and Moon? Yes, it was. One, two, three, four. Oh, uh, let's see. Let's go with a little grass. I'm getting a lot dark today. I don't know why. Don't know why. I've got a Torah Cat, a Kabutop, a Nidorino, a Weedle, a Helotop, an Executor, or Execute, Execute, Ferris Seed, 
a Meowth, another Ferris Seed, and woo, a Cabo Lion GX. I'm going to look that price up right now, guys. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> Current, and this is the 106 number, so currently it's at $2.20 value, which is not that bad, really. I honestly, so, but it's going to be put in our good pile. So, all right, guys. That puts us up to seven good cards today. Seven really good cards. <clears throat> and sorry about that. So, all right, guys. You know what? That's the first time I've ever seen that Cobble Lion. I'll be honest with you today. Um, most of the all right, now this one, this one, uh, what did I just toss? I had a Primal Clash. I had a, I think I had an Ancient, no, I had a Roaring Skies. Okay, we're going to go with Roaring Skies. And there's your code card and another one that means, that might mean something. That might. So it's been meaning something so far, so let's see what it does now. So we're going to go, let's see, we're going to have to go back to our, the price guide and go back to, uh, Roaring skies. <clears throat> See what we get. All right. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Go back over here. One, two, and three. So, Executor. Mind you. Okay. Hold on for one minute. I'm just double checking. Sorry about that, guys. I don't want to. I'm trying to divide. Hopefully, get the, all each card not. Mixed up so much. Executor. Alteria. That's just an uncommon. An electrode. Pikachu. Anybody want a Pikachu? I got a Pikachu. Binnacle. A Wingle. Spiro. Shuppet. Oh, a Dust Trusks. That's a nice looking card right there, honestly. As well as a Salamance. Let's see. Let's check these cards out. Let's see what we got for um, in value. Because I think this is what they call a Dust Toss Delta card, is from what it says. It's not worth much. It's about 15 cents right now. But that Salamant, let's see what that Salamant card is worth on uh, so far. That's a 36 cent card. So that's really not much there, too. <clears throat> Perfect. All right, guys. I don't know if I gave you the Roaring Skies booster pack, booster code. But let's see what else we can do. And it. If you guys are liking this stream, please subscribe. Please hit the like button. I really appreciate it. I mean, I would, if you don't, that's okay. You don't have to. But, uh, all right, we got another good one. There we go. For whoever wants it next, Primal Clash XY. Believe me, I use some of them, but I don't use all of them myself. I've got a few, um, these ones, the ones I'm showing you, I'm pretty much not using, so you guys can use them if you want to, believe me. All right. And what we got, we're going to, did I do the card trick? Yes, I did. I did the card trick. Okay. Uh, Cedra. Oh, forgot. I got to put that over there somewhere. I got, I got an Agron Spirit Link. I got a Wish Cash. I got a Tentacool. A Torchic, a Hippopotamus. We got we got Skirskits all over the place. Look at this. I got a Barboach. I've got an Acrobike. 
And I've got a Grudon EX card, guys. Look at this pull. Now that is what I'm talking about. Let's see here. I have I have to go back over here to Primal Clash to see what I actually got worth on my uh, pay card. All right, Primal Clash, where are you at right now? There you are. Let's see. <clears throat> and we're going to see, we're going to see, we're going to see. Let's see. Grudon EX is a $2.10 card. So that goes into one of my good sleeves. I'm going to like this one. I really do like some numbers here. Oh. All right, guys. I'm getting into – now I've got into my uh, Crimson Invasion. I'm going, I've got one pack of Crimson Invasion for you guys. To see, um, I know it's starting to get dark out there. So, co card for you guys. And I've also got, it's going to be a green card. So, let's see. Since it's a sun and moon, four cards split. Lightning energy. Counter catcher. Haunter. Sea of nothingness. Yeah, it sounds like my mind half the time. Corfish, Ghastly, Houndour, Staryu, Jengmo. Oh, I got a friend, a female friend of mine that's going to love that little jiggy puff, Jigglypuff and a Militich. So we're going to go over here to Crimson Invasion. I know I've got a Crimson Invasion binder I'm putting together. Uh, that's going to be a couple cards. I'm going to, I might add that. To that binder of mine. Let's see what we get. Is it worth it? It is. It's 50 cents on the... It's 49 cents, but 50 cents on the dot. So that Militich is going to be our next sleeve up card. All right, it's right there on the board cusp. So we're doing pretty good with these pulls, guys. Um, I'm down to four four things left. And if I didn't give you the code card before, here it is. Um, so I'm down to my last four packs, guys. And it's Cosmic Eclipse. I was just putting together today a Cosmic Eclipse binder. So, hope we're trying, we're trying. We're trying to get everything I can do with these numbers. All right, let's see what we get here, guys. I got another code card for you. And it was a greenback, so it's probably not going to be anything. One, two, three, four. Cosmic Eclipse, here we come. I got a... Fairy Energy. I got a Pipe Pyroar. A Hakamoa. A Rotom. A Sunkern. A Cosmog. Sign? Sign that? Trap Pinch. If you're need if you're ever in a trap pinch, call me up. Oddish. Phantom. And a Weavile. Weavile, let's see. I want to see. I'm trying to catch them all. I'm trying to. Well, actually, I'm trying to collect them all. So let's just put it that way. Uh, Cosmic Eclipse. Let's see what. <coughs> sorry about this. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can get that. If Weavile is going to be put in a sleeve. I'm going to go check, 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 check me. No, Weavile is only going to get a 15 cents. So if you guys like the live stream better than the just po uh, uploading videos, please let me know in the comments 
Uh, I appreciate it because the fact is, it seems like a lot more people are watching the live streams more than they do. The, I put episode four that I put out was actually part of just to see if I can upload it and not worry about the live stream. I'm not, I'm getting, I'm so new to this because it's normally, I would rather speak and show you guys live what you guys are watching instead of, and you can always go back and watch it later if you need to, but a lot more people like watching the live stuff, especially if you're like me and you like watching live sports. So, all right, there's your code card, guys, and it's only green, so, yeah. Let's see, one, two, three, four. Let's get back to that channel. All right, guys. Lightning energy. I got a Cynthia and Caitlin. Ooh. You know what? I just want to check something because I think that's worth these trainer cards. Some of these uncommon trainer cards are actually worth some money too. So I just, not just – I thought I saw the Cynthia up there in the 50-cent range. So – it is that common card. Guess what? Guys? This Cynthia and Caitlin card is sitting at 90 cents right now. And, it, and the reason why I put the 50 cents up, 50 cent mark, is because of the fact is if most of you all know that most of these packs, just buying one single pack is almost about five bucks if you include taxes and everything. Divide that by the 10 cards that are inside, you're getting about 50 cents. So if you can actually get a card inside the pack that actually makes more money than what you bought it for, that's a pretty good card. So <clears throat> let's get back to the action. I have myself a Heracross. Um, uh, Araquanid. Oh, Pikachu. A Stuffle. A Ponar, a Litleo. <coughs> Coughing. Togo tomorrow. That's like the first Togo tomorrow I got in a long time. And an Ente. And with it being rare, we got, always got to make sure we get. Ente is only a 26 cent card. So that actually, that Cynthia and Caitlin was our actually best card in, in the deck. So. All right, let's see what else we got. Um, for all you guys, if you guys are brand new to the channel or if you guys just came in, welcome. And I uh, appreciate you guys showing up. Um, I'm down to my last two packs, so hopefully we can get through this to get together. If you And if you just showed up, please just, uh, if you guys like the video, subscribe and or hit the like button, whichever one you feel like doing. Um, I appreciate it. Uh, it just tells me basically I've actually been seeing a lot of the likes and from my previous openings compared to my sports talk openings. And I see that people are liking more of these Pokemon live videos more than my sports talk. So basically, and since sports are not going on right now, I'm going to try to keep doing these as much as I possibly can, as much as I can afford, really. Um, there's your code card, guys. And guess what? We have something. One, two, three, four. Let's see. Is it a secret rare? Is it? Is it? All right. Now that I've gone a little crazy. Uh, Metal. Absol. Flareon. Roller Skater. I don't think I have one of those. Uh, Cosmog. A Ponita. A Crab Brawler. A Carvanaw. A Chinchow. A nose pass and an ultra necrozma. My who the light one, the light one, guys. When have you guys ever? I'm I'm sorry, I gotta check to see that ultra necrozma being an, <clears throat> an ultra beast and all that. He's gotta be at least a few bucks. He is a 90 cent card. So, 
Guys, that is a good pull. That is really good pull. 90 cents. I'll take it. I'll take it in any way I can get it right now. <clears throat> yeah, I was looking, like I said, if you guys want to, if you're collecting cards and all that, please just uh, have some fun with it. I mean, it's enjoy it. I always enjoy pulling these kind, of, pulling these cards, showing you what I pull, guys, because you guys are seeing the cards just before, like I'm seeing them. Very first cards. Of, I got one more set, and there's your code card for you guys. Uh, I got one. These cards, a lot of people do not realize that this trend has been going on for 20 years. These Pokemon cards have been going on for 20 years. They're going to be – you're going to have fun with them. You're going to enjoy them. Um, a lot of people play against them. People use them for to the battle. Some people use them to collect. So, I mean, there's a lot of things that you're going to do with these cards. But I'm here to make – to show you guys that there is some value in every card. I mean, every card's got anywhere from five cents on up. So even if you buy a 50 cent card, there's those ultra rares are always going to be around about 15, 20 cents or the, not the ultra rares, but the rares are going to be around 15, 20 cents and up. So if you're looking for some cards, like literally I, we pulled some good ones. At least we know we pulled some good ones today. So let's see last pack guys. Water, Heracross, Lily's Pokey Doll, a Dra Dragonium Z. Let me double check on that one. Dragon, because I think those, uh, I want to say these trainer cards, sometimes these trainer cards can be worth more. Like I said, I just pulled a uh, tag team trainer that was actually pretty good in the middle. Nah, that one's only worth about five cents. Don't worry about it. So, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at and we see oh uh, Teddy Ursa. I see a nose pass. I see a Litleo. I see a baby. I see a Safil. And a lonely muck. As a matter of lonely mucks. Lonely mucks. I love those. Give me some lonely mucks. We'll be do good all day. Yeah, that's also that was also a rare too. So, it, but it being a hollow rare and a sunflora, sunflora. So, it's a lot of people look at me and they go, James, why you do this? Why are you doing Pokemon? Aren't you a little too uh, old for this? Believe me, you're never too old to have a little fun in your life. So, if you guys are feeling a little down, you can always come to this channel, and I I talk about different things. I can talk about – one day I can talk about sports. The next day I can talk about Pokemon. The next day I could talk about the weather. I mean, come on. This is a channel for us to have some fun, not worry about a lot of – get our minds off of the things that are going on in life, and just have a good time. So um, I, I want to say I want to preach some uh, positivity for everybody, and I hope that you all enjoyed this channel because – I just finally found that sunflower. And it's about twenty cents, so it's not really worth anything. So to show you what all I got, guys, uh, let's just say I we've got our Mega Blastoise EX. We had that Gyarados. We had that Mega Venusaur EX. We had the Toxtricity V, full art, the full art one. We had the Galarian Weezing. We had the Col Galarian Cursola. We also had that Kabbalah MV or GX. We had the Grudon EX. We had ourselves a Militich. We had the Cynthia and Caitlin tag team trainer card as well as the Ultra Necrozma. So I don't know. Let me do an official count. We had 11. And I mind you, and I think I bought almost about, I think I had about 21 to 22. And that's not including, I didn't check up all my card. I think I might have missed uh, another valuable card in all those packs from those on comments. But whatever I remember, um, that's what I've, I have found. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and just didn't, I've got these new cards to add to the uh, the binders and the collections. 
and hopefully that we can actually sooner or later I can get these uh these bins on or these binders on eBay so I can send them out and you guys can have a full full collection for you guys uh appreciative and uh, hopefully hopefully this and I said my own little munchlax is gonna be um, here hanging out with me while I'm putting some of my cards around. So I appreciate it. If you guys like the video, please hit the like button. If you guys don't want to subscribe and listen, watch more other videos later, uh, please hit the subscribe button. I appreciate it. And for those guys that like me, thank you very much. Um, that's basically, unless I'm missing a pack somewhere, um, I think, uh, let me just double check. I am not. So, I thank you for all showing up to the video, guys, and I appreciate it. Uh, from, from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate it. Um, stay stay positive out there. Stay uh, focused and enjoy life. Enjoy living and be safe out there. I know it's uh, hard to set, say with what's going on in the world today, but you know what? Just be safe. Be, be positive. Uh, as a... As a whole, we're going to get through this. So I appreciate it, and thank you very much for watching this video. And a shout-out to all those hospital workers out there that are putting their lives on the line. And uh, From the lion's den, I'm going to give out one of my signature roar, and I'm out.